annual charity bazaar has been a great financial success. Ladies, we took in over $10,000 for charity. I'm overjoyed. I'm overwhelmed. And I'm over $10,000 richer. What kind of a guy would steal from charity? The same kind of a guy who'd take candy from a baby. The hotline. Batfink here. Batfink? Somebody just took money from a charity and candy from a baby. Can you imagine anyone being so cruel? Yes, I can, Chief. The king of cruelty. Old King Cruel. I must locate Old King Cruel's whereabouts. My supersonic sonar radar will help me. That makes beep. That beep? I wonder what's taking your beep so long. Here it comes now, Karate. And it found Old King Cruel. That's pretty cruel to make a beep weep. Let's go. Batfink, I'll be ready and I'll be cruel. I'll take the back door, Karate. You take the front. He must be hiding. Maybe he's in that closet. Ow! How cruel can you get? I don't know. Let's find out. Old King Cruel, you belong behind bars. Maybe, but I'm going behind karate. Your bullets cannot harm me. My wings are like a shield of steel. If you take one step forward, I'll shoot karate in the head. You'd better go back, Batfink. And if you take one step backward, I'll shoot him in the back. Stand still, Batfink, and don't move a wing. Now do what I say or else. Put your wings up. Now grab the tips of your wings with your hands. Pull your wings as far apart as you can. And now, let go. Old King Cruel, you couldn't be crueler. And for Batfink, it's goodbye, cruel world. Batfink, I call this the die laughing bit. While you die, karate will be laughing. I would never laugh at Batfink's dying. Oh, yes, you will. Because when I tickle your foot, your toe will fire that cannon. <laughs> what cruelty to be destroyed by your best friend. Karate would never have dreamed of harming Batfink, but now he's tickled to do it. Karate, you laughed so hard, you pulled the cannon off its pedestal. And it crowned Old King Cruel. It's jail for you, Old King Cruel. And when you get out, you won't be Old King Cruel anymore. You'll be old, old King Crawl. The popular television talk show, Shoot Your Mouth Out. And now let's meet another member of our studio audience who wants to shoot his mouth off. Your name, sir? My name is Victor the Predictor. And I predict that Batfink is finished. <laughs> You're really shooting your mouth off. The famous Ruby Red Ruby will disappear right under Batfink's nose. He'll run out of gas. And the curtain will finally come down on him and his career. <laughs> Kindly throw this predictor out. What Victor the Predictor predicts always comes true. Boy, what a good show this week. I'm not going to worry about his predictions for me, but we'd better check on the Ruby Red Ruby.
Little does Batfink know, but I've already stolen the ruby red ruby and left one of these duplicates in its place. And the duplicate has been treated to disintegrate as soon as it is touched. The ruby red ruby is right where it belongs, Karate. That predictor was crazy. He said it would disappear right under your nose, and it's still right there. Where? It disappeared. Right under your nose. Just as Victor the Predictor predicted. He also predicted you'd run out of gas and the curtain would come down on you and your career. His first prediction coming true was merely a coincidence. That think? We just ran into another coincidence. You ran out of gas. You go to the gas station down the road, Karate. I'll locate the Ruby Red Ruby with my supersonic sonar radar. The ruby red ruby is the final ingredient I needed for my laser gun. Now the beam from my laser can slice through a solid steel bank vault like butter. It can also make a hole in my house. Beautiful. I predict I'll soon be the richest predictor in the world. That thinks beep. Ha! Now to make my last prediction come true. You wait here, Karate. Victor, the predictor. And just as I predicted, the final curtain is about to fall on you and your career. Your predictions cannot harm me. My wings are like a shield of steel. But the ruby red ruby in the laser gun makes a beam that penetrates steel. It's curtains for Batfink. Will Victor the Predictor be the victor? Is Batfink Victor's victim? Has Victor licked him? See, look at that. It's, it's, it's not doing a darn thing, is it? No. You were fooled by your own duplicates. You put in the wrong ruby. This is the real ruby, Red Ruby. How about that? Good work, Karate. Look, my final prediction did come true. The curtain did come down on Batfink. Wrong, Victor. These are not curtains. They're drapes. Victor, you should have known. Batfink is unpredictable. Victor!